Hi guys, today we're talking about five staple colognes for men. So if you are just starting your cologne collection or if you're wondering like what colognes do I choose to really have a full range of what I need for my everyday and special occasions, then stay tuned. Three, two, one, let's do this. My name is Monica Cho and on this channel we talk about fragrances. So if you're interested in fragrances then press that subscribe button and the notification bell. Let's start with the staple collection. So for the staple collection I really thought about people who are just starting out the cologne collection, which designer fragrances because all of them are designer, yes, all of them are designer. Which ones are must have? Like the five that I would pick that are the best of the best and you'll be covered from special occasions to just normal casual wear to just anything. And let's start with number one staple cologne that is just the best. It is. Alu Homme's fourth exam and I've got a full review of this fragrance on my channel. This is amazing. If I was going to say you have no fragrances at all and, I, and you were asking me which cologne do I buy, this one would be the first one straight out of my mouth because it will cover you from day to night. It's very good quality. It's amazing projection and the scent cloud of this fragrance. It's amazing. It's sexy without being too sexy. It's classy and just French. It's it's so French. That's what I really smell when I smell this. It is smooth. It's got a vanilla. It's tonka bean. Um, it's got mint and mandarin in this. So this is refreshing, but also smooth and slightly sweet, perfectly balanced in the air. It's just so sexy. A guy just wearing a white shirt could be wearing this in the South of France. Amazing, expensive smelling for not so much uh, in terms of price. So definitely this is a staple, guys, like staple of the staples. I love um, Sportex them and I know I'm not the only one who says that. Another staple uh, I think should be Dolce & Gabbana Light Blue or Intense Pour Homme. This is a long name but basically what this fragrance will do for you is it will be an amazing summer weather fragrance. It does last which is not it's just not very common for fragrances summer fragrances to last this will last this is a sexy summer out of the shower scent that women absolutely love so you'll get loads of compliments for sure this is no brainer easy scent this has got also some backbone to it so although it's juicy and um citrusy at the top very, very delicious like it's got some grapefruit and other citruses at the top it also has got some darkness in there so it's got the backbone this is why i think it lasts a long time because it it does have like spices and i think it's got patchouli I'm not 100 percent sure but i think it does have patchouli in it so it makes it a bit dark and spicy um this is just an amazing sexy all-rounder uh, summer fresh fragrance next up we've got a designer fragrance again oud wood even if you're not fan of wood fragrances you will probably really like this one this is a very easy going oud this is a unique fragrance so you'll need one unique fragrance in your collection that is not just like they're all good but this one is a standout sort of scent if you want to impress if you know that uh, where you're going loads of people will be wearing cologne and you want to smell a bit different this is the one for you extremely masculine really good performing um, just all around a very masculine well put together sophisticated but not too sophisticated scent that you can always wear with just a t-shirt so it's versatile and compliments with this one are really really good may i say so amazing next one is of course ysl la nuit de l'homme this is 
an all-time favorite daytime fragrance. In terms of performance, maybe it's not the best, but if you spray enough of it around you, you won't smell too strong because it's a softer, smoother sort of scent. So don't be afraid to spray that one a lot. It's a lavender cardamom scent with bergamot at the top, so it's slightly fresh. It's just a perfectly balanced scent that comes together to just smell so warm, cozy, delicious, just so good. I haven't met a girl that doesn't like this fragrance. It's one of the best selling daytime fragrances, designer fragrances, and to me, it's a staple. It's something that you just you just own because so many people talk about it and for a good reason. So why sell La Nuit de Long? Lastly, there is a fragrance that you want to wear maybe when you want to be a bit more formal. You want a special occasion or maybe you're going to a wedding or maybe uh, you're going to a black tie event and you want to design a fragrance that you can just buy and it will just fit perfectly. And for me that fragrance is Prada L'Homme. And that fragrance is a soapy, fresh iris scent and it's very gentlemanly. When you smell it, you might think, oh, do I really like it? Is it very, very good? It is, it's unique. Iris is not a note that is often found in designer fragrances. So this one is special and it's really done with a lot of class. It's not a heavy iris. If you don't like iris in general, you still might like it because it's a fresh iris, it's a fresh fragrance that will just make you smell very clean, good and yeah, well put together, very easy going, every age will like this fragrance, it's not a conversation starter but it's just something when you need a fragrance that will just work if you know what I mean. So that is Prada L'Homme. Let me know which fragrances are staple fragrances um, in your collection because I think it's important to have that basis for all your fragrances to just build, build on top of that. Uh, I post every Monday and Thursday so do press that notification bell to get notified and let's read the comment of the day. Next comment of the day is from Petar Kiryakov. He says, amazing list, Monica, and that was for my last list of top summer fragrances for men. So if you haven't seen that one yet, definitely go and check it out. And remember, if you love a fragrance, no matter what the marketing team are telling you, you can wear it. And I'll see you all again very, very soon, guys. Bye.